My name is Dr. Patricia Collard, and I'm a trained cognitive behavioral psychotherapist, a coach, a mindfulness trainer, and also a university lecturer. In the 1990s, I lived in the Far East for nine years, one year in Hong Kong, eight years in China. And during that period, I familiarized myself and observed Tai Chi, Qigong, yoga, and meditation and finally started practicing Tai Chi meditation and yoga. I had no idea that actually, meanwhile, while I lived in China, mindfulness had started to be used in hospitals and later on in psychotherapy. So when I returned to the UK in 2000, I became an ardent student of famous people like John Kabat-Zinn, and Saki Santorelli and studied MBSR and MBCT. In the early 2000s, I then became a mindfulness-based cognitive therapy trainer. I did my training at Bangor University, the center for mindfulness in the UK. And I had wonderful trainers like Rebecca Crane, John Teasdale, Mark Williams. And when I went on the retreat, I met people like Christina Feldman, etc. So I had really wonderful teachers who gave me a lot of insight in how mindfulness and mindfulness meditation can be used to improve other people's lives. But apart from that, I'm actually also a very active writer. I love writing. I always did since childhood. My latest book is a children's book that came out in December 2016 and it's called Tips the Meditation Cat. It's for children from about the age of five years. And it talks about my cat, who is called Tibbled, or short Tibbs, who loves to be with people when they meditate. Other books I've written are The Mindfulness Bible, Mindfulness for Compassionate Living, The Mindfulness Diet, The Mindfulness Cookbook, MBCT for Dummies. And my most important book to date is the smallest one. It's called The Little Book of Mindfulness. It has been on the bestseller list at Amazon at least eight or nine times. And also in Germany, it has been a bestseller. But it's been translated into 10 different languages. People seem to like the small format because it's li really a little pocket book that you can put in a pocket or in a handbag and read whenever you're waiting anywhere. So rather than getting annoyed at wasting time, you can read my little book of mindfulness. Now, this particular course that you've just decided to enter is going to train you in the basic skills you need for running the eight-week MBCT course. So you're going to learn a number of different meditations, how to guide them, and after the meditation, how to run an inquiry. The inquiry process is there to help people express what they experience during a particular meditation. And there will be another video that will tell you about the process of inquiry. During this course, you will initially form small groups, guide each other in meditation, and then in Skype supervision sessions, we're going to help you express how to deal with certain difficulties and see whether you're getting on all right. Eventually, we'll meet in Dublin or London for two days with two trainers, myself and a co-trainer, and you will actually have to demonstrate the skills that you've learned. You will each guide one or two meditations in front of a slightly bigger group and then run an inquiry. And thereafter, all the participants, the teachers like me and the other participants are going to give you feedback so that you become even better at the skill of running meditations and inquiries. Eventually, at the end of this course, teacher development level one, you will actually be a teacher in training and you will have to guide at least three MBCT 
courses under heavy supervision before you can then attend teacher development level two. And by the way, one thing I forgot, I'm also a member of the Mindfulness Trainers UK network and I'm one of their training organizations and I'm also one of the people who look at people who are applying for the teachers listing which means that you can be visible you know on the listing and people will actually see that you've done appropriate training and I'm one of the people who decides whether somebody is ready to go on the listing. I'm pretty sure that if you fully apply yourself to this course you will get ready and you will become a wonderful mindfulness teacher. I very much look forward to working with you. Much kindness. Patricia